would burn nicely. This is it. All the tubes lead to this spot. Edie, what can you tell us? What are they doing? The tubes are feeding into some kind of superstructure. It is emitting both organic and non-organic energy signatures. Given these readings, it must be massive. Shepard, if my calculations are correct, the superstructure is a Reaper. Not just any Reaper. Collectors gain by turning humans into this Reaper shell. They may be facilitating the Reaper equivalent of reproduction, or it may serve another purpose. I do not have the data to speculate further. However, it is clear that the Collectors are merely pawns. The technology and ability needed to create this Reaper is not their own. It is likely that different species construct each Reaper. In this case, the Collectors provide the labor. The Collectors are just Protheans. Why would they help the Reapers? The Reapers subdued the Protheans long ago. Probabilities suggest they attempted to create a Prothean Reaper and failed. Over time, they adapted the Protheans to suit their needs, changed them, turned them into workers. Tools for the Reapers. They're building it to look like a human. Why? It appears that a Reaper's shape is based upon the species used to create it. Reapers are machines. Why do they need humans at all? Incorrect. Reapers are sapient constructs, a hybrid of organic and inorganic material. The exact construction methods are unclear, but it seems probable that the Reapers absorb the essence of a species, utilizing it in their reproduction process. How many more humans do you think they'd try to take? Millions. Perhaps more. Impossible to know for certain. This Reaper appears to be in a very early stage of development. An embryo in human terms. So it's not alive yet? We can still stop it from being... created? The process can be stopped, but it is unclear exactly how much it has developed. I cannot, for example, tell you if it has awareness. It's too big for our guns. Edie, find me a way to blow this thing to hell. The large tubes injecting the fluid are a weak structural link. Destroying them should cause the supports to collapse, and the Reaper to fall. Give us a minute, Edie. We've got to take care of some old friends first. Hostiles on approach! Enemy fire imminent. Assuming control of this form. This is true power. Oh, just to think they have killed that one. Oh. Your form is fragile.
lost the target. Shoot the damn tubes! Fuck it! Team, status report. It's they. We are holding, but they keep coming. A quick exit is preferable. Head to the Normandy. Joker, prep the engines. I'm about to overload this place and blow it sky high. Roger that, Commander. Uh, Commander, I've got an incoming signal from the elusive man. He's patching it through. Shepard. You've done the impossible. I'm not finished here yet. This base is ten minutes from extinction. Wait. I have a better option. I'm looking at the schematics Edie uploaded. A timed radiation pulse would kill the remaining collectors, but leave the machinery and technology intact. This is our chance, Shepard. They were building a Reaper. That knowledge, that framework could save us. I came here to destroy it. But if you have another idea, I'm listening. We've won a single victory, but we're still at war. This base will give us the technology we need to fight the Reapers. Maybe it's for the best. Leadership means making sacrifices. You know that better than anyone, Shepard. A threat this big, rules go out the window. If this station can help stop the Reapers, we have to use it. You're making the right choice. Move. In 10 minutes, the reactor core will fire a radiation blast that kills anything on board. 